Hi there Virgo, how are you today? Welcome to your career and money reading and this is for Virgo Sun Moon Rising and it's timeless whenever you get to this message and the first few cards resonate for your current situation. This might also resonate if you've got Virgo in placements in your chart that are aligned with career and money. So sometimes first house, second house, eighth house, seventh house, tenth house, and sometimes um, fifth and sixth. It depends on your placements in your chart, but it might resonate if you've got strong Virgo in career money placements as well. So let's have a look, Virgo, at what spirit want to bring forward with your current situation and all things career and money we've got frozen there may be a hiring freeze or no new work now be, being aloof can leave you out in the cold a warm follow-up gets you in the door okay let's see what this might be to do with what else for virgo Oops, okay, we have answers. You will resolve your current situation soon. Work-wise, you find unique ways to stand out. You find a new opening with job security. There's something about the current situation that feels uncertain. Um, we've got wisdom. You are called to serve as a mentor for someone or as a role model and guide who you can show the way or as a role model and guide who can show the way use your wisdom and experience sorry that i could this i'm still on this energy with with the with this wisdom there is the layer of wisdom that comes through with a situation that feels very detached there's been decisions some somewhere that is the very business-based decisions they don't feel like they are encompassing the like the staff or the the workers or customers very inclusively or very considerately there's something that you can do to change this though i feel or to speak to that energy we've got many choices you have options even if you don't see them right now get creative and look around pull a card for each option to see what's best yeah there's when this frozen came out, I felt like some of I felt the energy was like you want you wanted it to be something to be frozen or you wanted a detachment from something because something doesn't feel good to you. It feels cold and we've got trapped. You feel stuck in your current situation, but you have options. Look for another job while keeping the one you have for now. Yeah, there's you want to make a shift because for a lot of you, I feel like you don't enjoy something to do with the work how you work or where you work and we've got give and take be open to giving and receiving to keep the flow of abundance going give someone a chance and ask for what your heart desires okay and we've got signs you are putting together pieces of the puzzle from signs you are getting pay attention to the coincidences you experience I feel like for a lot of you, Virgo, you feel that there's something new coming, but it feels it's not here just yet. You're kind of picking up on the energy and expression. You need work that lets you express your creative self. You could do well at writing, blogging, or a career in communication. There's something unfulfilling and very detached on a human to human level, like how people take care of people with a current situation if this isn't a current situation it's energy about with an old position that's still strong with you that you feel like you would do anything not to go back into so the energy still feels quite strong um but there are the, and there is a feeling of stuckness here with this trapped energy but spirit is saying there's choices let's have a look what else is happening on your pathway and look at this a little bit deeper see what might be coming up for you i feel as well for a lot of you if this is resonating with the current situation you have um you've outgrown where you are and we've got angel of strength 
What else for Virgo energy, please, Spirit? This is working two ways for me, this energy, actually. It's coming through as the strength to make change in where you are. And it's also the strength to move on to something else. As we're talking about that, we've got blossoming abundance. There's something where you coming up and shining up brings a lot of abundance into your life. A lot more satisfaction. It could be this expression, doing something completely different. Or making, go, oops, going along a different pathway. Okay, they came very strong there. Okay, let's have a look. Okay, we've got Broken Heart, The Temple Path, The Thinking Woman, and First Chakra, Archangel Michael. Yeah, you're rooting something new here. Something new coming in. Broken Heart. There could be just a, there could be some feeling of pain or worry that's coming with these choices that need to be made but we do have the answers are coming okay but there is an uncomfortable energy surrounding this for you as well virgo the temple path i do feel where you are now isn't where you're supposed to be and these uncomfortable energies is are kind of like shifting you and we've got the thinking woman. Yeah, it's time to think really about what you want to do, where you want to be. Um, and that could be staying where you are and making changes, or that could be moving on to a different pathway. Okay, let's look a little bit deeper, Virgo. Let's have a look, see what else is coming or appearing on your pathway with this energy. I think they needed a bit more of a shuffle. There we go. Okay, we have goblins. Current situation is throwing up not nice sides of other people. And one ring circus. If you have any doubts, Virgo, that you would not be able to, to do something on your own, side hustle, business, project, whatever it is, however it applies for you, this is Spirit saying to you, you can start something completely on your own if you want to. This is also feeling like there could be somebody who's like running the show and it's a, it's it really is a circus. It's just not in alignment with your own values. And we've got flying. <laughs> this is the joy and the abundance when this energy is cut loose. Dragon's layer, yes. There is uh, not wanting to go into a situation that feels like you are walking into, from one bad situation into another. There's a worry about leaving where you are and you end up in just the same situation or even a worse situation. It's kind of like, is it, it is it the devil you know? Is that better? Let's have a look at the tarot and see what else spirit want to say about this situation. Because it feels like you're in between. You're not quite decided. You know that you're not happy where you are, messenger of earth. Okay. What else for Virgo, please, Spirit? Okay. <laughs> I just feel like something else was going to fly there. Okay. Right. We have. Let me just cut these. Okay. We have Messenger of Earth. We've got four of air. This is you being in contemplation, not knowing which way really to go. Page of fire. I feel like the steps that you take are going to be 
the right steps. We've got six of uh, six, six of pentacles. This is this give and take energy as well. It could be somebody else that you can ask for help here. Yeah. You, oh, I was just about, okay. I was sorry. I was, there was, there's a real strong feeling coming from the energy of this messenger of earth. It feels like you are not being heard. It feels like you are, your ideas can't come into fruition in the situation you're in, but your ideas are for the good of all. Your, your, the way that you would reconstruct or redesign um, the career situation, the financial situation, somebody spending irresponsibly perhaps. Um, and then we've got the call. It's like, it's, I do feel like you're speaking up for other people in the workplace as well. Yeah. We've got conflict, fire and fire. You, yeah, you, this is spirit recognizing how you are showing up for other people and fighting for other people. And Empress, yes, this is your abundance right here. The abundance comes in when you, when you rise above all of what's been happening or all of what is happening, or the energy you're picking up on an energy um and you you are rising above it and it's making people feel very uncomfortable you're helping people rise above that and you're standing in this empress energy and you're able to nurture people through this uncomfortable situation oh okay we've got the moon yeah, this is balancing, balancing of the energies. This is also just trusting your gut. This is under, also, you understand why other people are making the moves that they're making. You're very astute with how you perceive other people. Your perception of other people is like bang on. We've got judgment again. Hmm. This really is beautiful. And we've got the Knight of Pentacles. Interesting. Because it's these two that came out before where the energy felt really strong and they've just come out together. This is spirit saying things in the physical are going to come into fruition for you because you're doing things for the highest good. You do, you're, you're moving in a way that is not just for you, it's for, for everyone. That's so interesting that they came out together. Okay, because that was what was very strong before. There's a protector in you, Virgo. And we've got the Seven of Cups. You're not quite sure. You don't know what, what decision to make. You don't know whether to stay where you are and fight or to just go it on your own or go and try somewhere else. What do we need to know about the Seven of Cups for Virgo? What do we need to know about the Seven of Cups? It's going to be different situations for everybody. Yeah, King of Pentacles. Whichever way you go, you're going, you're walking into this King of Pentacles energy. The choices you make will be the, will be the right choice based on your intuitive feeling. If you feel to be um, an advocate for people, then be the advocate. If you feel to walk away, it's time to walk away. It's like walking away. Um, but it's going to be different for for whatever situation you're in, but it's like, there's no, this isn't about the job. This is about you being in a place of care and compassion for others. Yeah. Cause you, whatever you do, you're, you're in magician energy, whatever you do, you're drawing on conscious energy. You're helping things transform with whatever you do. And that's, what's important right now. But this is also your ability to make, um, good financial decisions. Death and rebirth. We've got death coming through. Yeah, transformation. <laughs> you are tra absolutely transforming a situation. I, I want to say as well, like there is an element here of just allowing things to play out naturally, whether that means that you end up in a conversation with somebody where you say, do you know what, actually, no, this isn't for me. I think maybe I should go and find something else. Or um, if you say, actually 
I've decided that this isn't right for me and I'm going to go and start my own thing because you've got a lot of abundance. Whatever you, wherever you go, you've got this abundance and this King of Pentacles energy. Where were we here? <laughs> and we've got the star. Wish come true. This is spirit saying, don't worry, because your pathway, whatever way you go, you're, you're on a clear route to abundance here. What else for Virgo? Spirit, that we need to know about this five of fire, about this conflict. What do we need to know about this conflict? Yeah, this conflict is upsetting people. So we've got the hanged man not every there's a lot of people that are seeing something that's unjust and not not making a move this is also you being in suspense not knowing which way to go and just this is spirit saying allow things to plan to pan out you can see everything that's been happening five of pentacles yeah this conflict is making people feel really isolated i mean this is the left out in the cold energy this frozen energy but it's like showing people that there's a different pathway or taking a different pathway or both and we've got we've got the queen of wands and the wheel yeah when when there is passion inside of you to take action you'll feel it queen of wands empress and the wheel energy oh this is incredible and this flying energy as well it's very very conscious what you're doing deeply, deeply conscious and rooted in the well-being of others. Let's see what's being activated for you on a personal level through this situation. Okay. Oh, I was just about to uh, turn them all over. <laughs> What do we need to know for Virgo about activation, personal level activation on this career money pathway? We've got summoning power, instinct, intellect and control. I mean, that's this. <laughs> this is like incredible earthbound energy. You really understand how to control the energy of a situation. If you don't know that yet, or you haven't experienced that yet, that's coming in so that you can command the energy of a room for the highest good of everybody in that room. And people will listen to you. I almost feel as well with the, with this, with the answers and the feeling of not knowing which way to go, it's like there's people that you are working with or something that you're doing, you either the customers or people that you work with or something that you really enjoy about the job that isn't to do with what's happened in this frozen situation. This feels like it could be on like business owner level or um, managerial level in some way. Uh, and But there's the answers or it could be that other people are saying, do you know what, I'm going to leave or I found another job and that puts you on your pathway as well. Okay, let's have a let's have a look at your path. I feel like the message for you Virgo here really is about just trusting that there's no there's no wrong way here. It's like just trusting your intuition and where you feel like you've got synchronicity and serendipity coming in. This is that's your sign. This feeling of trapped will dissolve because it's like you're making these choices and you have absolutely everything you need with the wish come true, with the magician energy as well. We've got uh, quite a lot of Aquarius energy I'm picking up too. Either somebody that you're dealing with or perhaps in your chart. Okay, let's just have a look on pathway, what to expect. Or what, what to expect as you move uncovering treasure beneath the service surface lies great bounty yeah as you move you discover treasure oh sorry let me um put that so that you can see it there we go i need more room 
and wondrous universe of walking beauty. This is you being completely at one with the energy around you and seeing the beauty in things and fighting for that beauty. And we've got voyage of the heart. Love flows through you and to you. Yeah. Just this is really spirit saying carry on, carry on because this treasure is coming for you whichever way you turn and this blossoming abundance is coming gates of triumph success expands in your life amazing yeah you are on a winner you're on a winner this you've got a wish coming true you've got all of the tools and skills and ability you need to make anything happen that you want to happen there's this release as well of being trapped with this judgment energy with the like things are move things will start moving soon and it won't feel so stagnant i want to have a quick look here for you virgo about what might be kind of lying underneath the surface as you're in kind of this hanged man suspense mode what might be underneath the surface right now in this situation for virgo what's underneath the surface right now He's about to do the same thing again. <laughs> All of the cards. Okay. We have Mercury messages, travel, communication. Yeah. You're going to get communication about some, and I do feel this is somebody saying, do you know what, I'm leaving, and then you're going to decide to make a decision because there's nobody else there that, in your workplace that, um, that you want to work with or you get communication that there's like financial problems and or something happens in a message and that's going to be your sign we've got th yeah third eye clarity yeah it's going to give you it's going to give you some clarity here this communication coming in remember awakening this is your wisdom contracts career commitments and until debt tear us apart, Saturn. So yeah, there could be financial struggles somewhere that actually puts your position in a quite in a precarious position, puts your job in a, in a precarious position. Apology, forgiveness. I feel like some people this where this frozen situations come from does feel like a manager or somebody like a, or who acts like a manager, like self asserts themselves, might be coming in with this apology when they realise that they've lost the engagement of the team, stability, harmony, and flow. Yeah. You'll, you will, you will get this for yourself decisions. Yeah. When you, this is making the, when you make a decision and you kind of embrace these many choices and you take action, that's where the stability and flow comes in. Okay. Let's get some final words of advice for you. How you how you are like showing compassion and advocating for other people is truly beautiful, really truly beautiful, and we can see that just in the two judgment cards coming together alone, um, and because they came with the knight the knight of pentacles, both of them, it's like what you're doing, the responsibility of your actions and and how you are with money, but how you, also how you are showing up and how you are how you are working and your values and your principles be spirit sweet results await yeah spirit just saying to you there is uh there's success here there's a lot of abundance and, and success for you it just we're just in a bit of limbo at the moment and we've got be the spirit lay a solid foundation we've got dog spirit be loyal to what you love yeah this is really being like just sticking up for other people um and just standing by your values and we've got parrot spirit watch your words this is the conflict with other people this situation whoever else is involved in this situation where things are feeling a little bit uh might try and put you into a situation where you say something that um will be not and i do feel like you're not saying anything bad here um but will be twisted so just watch out for that 
be, be, yeah watch out for that especially if it's something to do with legal um if you say you know if you offer to extend your your kind of notice period or something yeah i want to say be careful of workplace gossip for some of you as well okay and it, this isn't something that you say that is bad this is how somebody twists something to cause maybe some drama but the drama uh, and some conflict uh, but it, it's hurtful um, and it, it wasn't from you okay what else okay right last piece of advice from spirit for you there go wolf pathfinder release your past and start a new journey you are a teacher and help others find their way there will be challenges but your soul is strong perseverance is your secret power you have a love that endures yeah it's interesting as well because we have the wolves on this energy which is what's being activated for you right now yeah beautiful virgo energy here as well it's coming through okay all right virgo I hope that that's helped you with where you are right now and as you travel onto some of these new pathways um, and the energy that you're experiencing in career and, and financial areas of your life. Thank you for watching the reading with me today as always and I will catch you next time. Take care.